Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. This week I'm using a free printable from Lovely Planner and I'm going to leave her link down in the description box. I've also pulled in three types of washi, although I only ended up using the skinny washi as the colours matched the kit perfectly. And as I couldn't cut this in my usual cutting software, I don't know why, but it wouldn't open, I had to go old school and either cut it out using my little craft knife or cut it out with scissors. So if you are new to my channel, I try to do free printable kits once a month. So that way you guys can find some kits that you can print and use as much as you like. And I just really like supporting all of the people that take the time to create the kits because as a creator myself, I know how much work goes into it. So I like to give them a bit of a shout out and also just share some really gorgeous kits with you all. The good thing about cutting these out is that you can place them down and arrange it how you want it if you're not sure without sticking them down and then wishing that you hadn't. So if you're not confident yet in your planner then maybe do it this way and that way you can kind of shuffle things about without sticking it down. I'm going to start with the skinny washi along the top which is exactly the same thing that I done last week. I believe it was the same washi. I'll have to check, I think it was. Um, and then we're just going to jump in day by day as I don't have any kind of large washi or anything to put down or date covers. I'm just writing down it's Monday and underneath I put a piece of washi and then on top of that I put a little poppet with the <laughs> face as Mondays is a <laughs> day. Mondays I work as well and I was catching a lift with a friend to work so I just wrote that down and then I put down my full box and these boxes aren't quite big enough for my planner so I'm kind of having to centre them as I go along. And then when I got home from work my son done some homework, he done his history homework so I just wrote that down and marked it with one of the pop it highlighters. And then underneath there I um, set up or started to set up my daughter's bullet journal. So I just wrote that down as well. As she really loves the bullet journal, she just struggles setting it up. I don't think she struggles, I just think it's a confidence thing. She's worried she's going to mess up. Whereas I mess up all the time, you just kind of, you just go with it. So I started setting that up for her last night and I do need to finish it. And then for Tuesday I started with this full box with the girl laying in bed which was kind of perfect for today as everyone was late up this morning. I slept through my alarm and the most annoying thing is my fiance woke me up this morning and I kind of woke up and had a full blown conversation with him and then he left the room and I fell back asleep. So there was that. My son missed the bus because obviously we were up late so he got into school late and everyone was late, so that was a really good start to my day. So once everyone had gone off to school and I'd got everything sorted, I wanted to edit this video and do my voiceover. And then I will be uploading this later tonight. So I just put down one of my Pop It YouTube stickers and wrote down upload. I also forgot to add in that I wanted to watch an American Horror Stories episode so I've just quickly marked that down just with a pen as obviously I haven't got any headers or little things with this kit. And then moving on to Wednesday. I finally have my drawing tablet fixed. I'm not sure if it's fixed fixed or just fixed for now fixed but very excited so I use one of the celebrate poppets and then I just write down a few things that I want to design and kind of just have a whole morning so I got it working on I think it was Saturday or Sunday I think it was Saturday and I worked the entire day because I was so frightened that it wasn't going to work anymore so I spent the whole day designing so I want to finish the designs up um, on 
Wednesday and then I do want to film another video so last year I think it was saying in, a, in another video that I have filmed lots of videos and I've edited them and then I don't upload them because I either chicken out or think oh nobody's gonna want to watch this so I've got lots of videos like that but this year I've decided I'm going to film videos and actually upload them so hopefully I'm gonna film again on Wednesday because I've got an idea for a video which hopefully you guys will enjoy um, I also need to double check my holiday requests so I've got some holiday to use up in my like full-time job and I've requested them I just need to double check on them and then I just filled the bottom up there with my full box as I want to be designing most of the day so I don't really have any other plans and then flipping the planner over I'm just using the skinny washi right at the top again and then for Thursday I want to organize my pantry I'm going to be emptying the entire thing out basically and giving it a really good deep clean and then putting everything back together in a more organized way And then I will be listening to a podcast, so I just use one of my Pop It podcast stickers. I filled up some space by using a full box, as I'm pretty sure it's going to take me the majority of the day. But I also, at the same time, want to try and deep clean my cooker, so I can kind of multitask. I can do both. I then put a half box down as I've got some orders that I want to post out on Thursday. I'm going to be packing them Wednesday night. I forgot to put that in my planner actually, but I'm going to be packing them Wednesday and then posting them off on Thursday. And then we have got a TV program called Teen Titans. And for Friday, as I have been back designing for the last few days, I will be having a new release on when, on Friday. So excited to be back designing. Um, the new release on Friday will be this washi strips. So this is the washi love sheet. It's got two washi strips on there that are specifically for Valentine's Day and the others are kind of just love themed. And so I put my full box down as I work on Friday as well, so it won't really be up to much for the rest of the day. And then at night I want to finish my daughter's bullet journal, so I just put down student bujo. And then for the TV programme we're watching on Friday is a new series called You. Um, we haven't watched it yet, so I can't say what it's like. I think that's on Now TV, no it's on Netflix. It's supposed to be a, a bit like Dexter. I don't know if anybody watched that series that was on Netflix, but it's supposed to be a bit a bit like that, and we really enjoyed that. So I'm looking forward to finding out if you is any good. And then for the weekend, I put the weekend banner down, and I need to do a food shop, and I also need to um, look out or buy a new helmet for my son, because he rides his bike to school now. It's starting to get lighter in the mornings, and I just want to get him a new helmet. He has got one at the moment, but we're gonna get him a new one. And also I want to see if I can film a Sims video. So it was before Christmas, I set up my second channel. It's called Simora, I will link it down below. But I've only got like two videos and maybe two subscribers. It's not, it's nothing yet. Do you know what I mean? I just thought I'd do it separately because I know some of you just like planning and not Sims. You don't even know about Sims, you don't care about Sims. So I thought if I just do it on a separate channel, it'll be a little bit easier. And then also um, for Saturday night, I want to make sure everyone does their homework so it's not such a rush on Sunday. And then moving on to Sunday, I want to film next week's plan with me. So I'm going to be doing that in the morning to make sure it's done. 
I then separated it with a piece of washi and one of the planner stickers from the Pop It planning sheet and then I put down another Pop It with a little planner there as I really need to set up my um, 2019 budget. I have not created my budget for this year yet so I need to do that. And then I put another Pop It from the Pop It planning sheet holding the stickers as I would like to film another video which is my sticker storage. If I don't get a chance to do it on the Sunday then I'll probably do it the following week but I kind of want to get that video up as well. I also need to go through and pack lunches for everybody for Monday morning so I've just reminded myself with a pop it lunch sticker and then down here I was writing that everyone needs to get their school bags ready for school the next day obviously um, and then I messed up the G, tried to correct it, it went wrong I didn't like it so what I done is just pulled out some plain sticker paper and then just cut it down to size and stuck it on top and although you can't see it on camera you can still see the word bags because obviously it was in thick black so I used another one of my washi strips so they're really good to cover up mistakes obviously and then I put another pop it bag down and just wrote down bags ready. And then flipping it over to the sidebar, I knew that this full box wasn't going to be wide enough because it wasn't wide enough in my planner boxes. So I just took some more of the white sticker paper to cover up any of the black um, dates that you could see through it on the side. I just covered it up with some white sticker paper. I then put down one of my Pop It Saving stickers as I'm doing the 52 weeks saving challenge. We are on week three, so I have to put aside three pounds and then altogether I've saved six pounds so far. And then moving on to my trackers, so I put a piece of washi down first just to separate them. And one will be for Instagram, one will be to make sure that I'm washing my face and moisturising. And then for my next week section, I went to put the washi down, but I didn't want the pink washi and the pink box to be next to each other. So I just swapped those two pieces of washi over and then put down a checklist for my next week section. And then as this kit doesn't come with any deco or washi, like wide washi that I would normally use at the bottom, I decided to pull in some more of this really thin washi as the colours really match the kit really well. So i just done two layers of that washi. And then to balance it out I added another strip of washi at the top to make it two lines at the top and two lines at the bottom. And that was it for this week's spread. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. I think it went better than last week's. No, I know it went better than last week's. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you did, then make sure you give me a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to check out my second channel if you are into Sims videos. I will be uploading them more now this year. I hope you're all having a lovely week so far and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.